What's up guys, this is Zach with ETS Tuning and we are back on the Mark 7.5 GTI sweepstakes where we're gonna give one of you that car and all you have to do to get entered to win is spend $50 at ecstuning.com and each multiple of 50 you spend gets you a new entry. For rules and regulations on the sweepstakes, check the link in the description below. This week is gonna be a good week. This is the week I've been waiting for and you've been waiting for. It is turbo time, it's time to add power. Okay, so Racing Line sent us their Stage 3 Plus kit, which is not currently available on the North American market, but we're gonna change that because this kit is awesome and we need it here in the States, so we're gonna make that happen. Uh, at the heart of it is their IS-38. It's not just any IS-38, it is their IS-38. They re-engineered it, it is ported, it's built for flow, it's got their custom billet compressor wheel and a cutback turbine wheel for increased airflow. Uh, an increased shaft diameter, and a 360 degree race spec thrust bearing. So this thing is ready to go. Uh, it's gonna last for a long time, very sturdy, and it's gonna flow a lot of air. Uh, it comes with their um, turbo muffler delete and their turbo inlet pipe, which are very nice looking and work very well with it. And with this little snail here, we intend to make, I'd like to see 450 at the crank. I would be happy, I'd be happy if we're above 400 at the wheels. Uh, so. That's the goal. We've got a lot of other stuff going on, so I, I think we'll be able to hit that uh, pretty reasonably. So 400 at the wheels, that's my goal. Uh, but we've got a, a lot of peripheral components to go with it, so let's talk about those. So uh, Raceman also sent us their oil catch can. Uh, really nice AN lines. It's a nice looking catch can. It should fit really well in the engine bay. Uh, so we'll install that. We've also got an oil cooler that isn't here yet. It's on the way. Uh, so we'll show you some shots of that at some point, but that'll also be nice to keep the turbo cool, keep the engine cool, keep everything running nicely. Uh, so otherwise, beyond that, New Speed sent us an exhaust, a turbo back, three inch all the way back. And this thing is beautiful. It's really nicely put together. Uh, so this is the downpipe. I don't have room for everything up here. We'll show you a few shots, but uh, big old downpipe. Let the thing breathe, let it flow. All right, so if we're letting more air out, then we need to be letting more air in. And for that, we have gone with our own ECS tuning, Cole Phaser Luft Technic intake system. It looks great, it works great, and it sounds great. Uh, it has a carbon fiber lid for aesthetics, uh, matches the rest of our carbon fiber stuff that we're gonna be putting on. We've got a carbon fiber engine cover, carbon fiber battery box, and a carbon fiber fuse cover. So this matches that well. It is super nice looking. Uh, and like I said, it sounds great. And we've seen uh, performance gains on stock cars. So with, with this turbo, we'll see even more gains, certainly. Uh, we'll figure out just how much later. So we're gonna be letting more air in, but it's gonna be hot, so we need to cool it down. So to do that, New Speed sent us their front mount intercooler. It's a really good looking unit, nice cast end tanks, beautiful TIG welds, and a really thick core. So this should do its job well, keep our IATs down low, and it's gonna look really good doing it, hanging out the front bumper, so I'm excited about that. Uh, beyond that, we've got a few other little things. Uh, Forge sent us this giant bag of silicone hoses. These are coolant lines, turbo lines, all sorts of things. Uh, they look good, that red will match things, and they're gonna be durable. They'll put up with the heat that this thing's gonna produce and all sorts of other things. So those will be awesome. Um, but other than that, I think, I think that pretty much covers it for this week. It's a lot of parts. It's gonna be a lot of work. So before I turbo that thing, I gotta turbo this thing. So I got me some of this, Gas Monkey Energy Drink.
Okay, so we got all the parts from the bench thrown into the car. Everything fit really well. Uh, the install went swimmingly. We just started it up for the first time. It sounds great at idle. Uh, we're not spewing fluids out of anywhere, so I think we're looking good, uh, which means we're ready to dyno. So we're gonna put this thing on the dyno. We've got a base map from Racing Line. So we're gonna start there, get some runs, and then go back and forth with Racing Line uh, to dial in the tune so we can start selling this kit. Uh, but that's gonna be for next time. Uh, this is going to wrap us up for today, so make sure that you comment on the video, that you like the video, that you're subscribed to the channel, and that you have the little notification bell rung uh, so that you get notifications when we come out with new videos, uh, like the next one, which is going to be us trying to see over 400 wheel horsepower on this sweepstakes car. So make sure you have all that done, and we'll see you next time.